tons of fun here on River City Live, and we love to hang out with fun people like comedian and actor Maz Jabrani, who's going to be at the Comedy Zone all weekend and fun. That's what we can expect when we see you at your show. Yeah. I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny, yeah. it's so cool. Talk a little bit about your background, because one of the things I love about comedy, it brings people together. Yeah. And your observations, where you're from, and how you kind of tell the differences when it comes to cultures and things like that. I, I've actually learned a lot you know, from you by watching it, uh. and I think that's a big part of it, but you also like laugh at the same time. Well, thank you for watching. And yeah, and, and, yeah I was born in Iran, and I grew up in Northern California, so I'm Iranian-American. And as you know, those two countries don't get along these days. <laughs> so yeah, I'm in the middle. I talk a lot about just being an immigrant in America and, and the different experiences we have, it's, especially now I have my own kids. So I'm seeing how we were raised and how we're raising our kids. Like one of the lines I say, and this is all true, I said, when I was a kid, I used to have to play with the kids of my parents' friends now I have to play with the parents of my kids. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that yeah. is so true. It's just come yeah. full circle. That so, is so funny and so right? true. Yeah, and it's always like kind of awkward feeling that out. Like, like, do we have something in common or not? Oh my God, so many times. Parents. Yeah. No, it's crazy because again, like when I was a kid, we would just walk into a party, and my Iranian father, immigrant dad, would just be, you know, say, you know, I'd be like five years old. He'd say, "Go, go play with Amir." <laughs> and I'd be like, uh, "Amir's 29 years old. <laughs> like, his, he's their son. Go play with him." <laughs> And now it's like you said, it's the opposite because I am at these birthdays sometimes and I'm just sitting there, you know, go, so, uh, you know, it's great. You're uh, Jack's dad, huh? And, uh, yeah. And I'm like, uh, what do you do? We have zero in common. Right. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, man. But then sometimes, you, you, you know, what, it's funny because the key is to find, if you find a mother and a father who you both get along with, your wife and you, yeah. it's like finding your uh, your wife again, you know? <laughs> We're gonna hang out with those people. <laughs> exactly, and it's so hard to do. It's so Because hard there's always do. one, you know, somebody in the family like, well, they're just okay. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, all the time. It happens like, we're, like we'll be leaving and then like, you know, my, I'll be like, they were pretty nice. My wife's like, are you kidding me? I'm like, what, what happened? What did I miss? Or so, what about if you and your wife like the parents, but your kid's like, no, I don't like their kid. Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> well, the crazy one was when, so when my kid was younger, now my son's 11, my daughter's eight. When my son was like four or so, we would get invites from birthdays because when you're in the class, everybody gets invited. Of course. And we didn't know who who it was, so we RSVP'd one time to a birthday for Carl, and we're in the car, we're driving, and I asked my wife, I go, so who's Carl? She goes, I have no idea. <laughs> and then I asked my son, I go, who's Carl? He's like, I don't know Carl. I go, who is this Carl? <laughs> right. And we got there, and it was this tall German guy, and he's like, I'm Carl, and I'm like, oh, I think we're at the wrong birthday. We're here for for his his friend. He goes, oh, that's Carl Junior, and it was his <laughs> son. <laughs> I was like, oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> He's named after a hamburger place. Anyway. Now, people can see you doing stand-up on Netflix. You've got specials out. But they can also see you on Superior Donuts. So, I mean, how has your comedy translated to acting? Yeah, well, you know, Superior Donuts was canceled, so thank you for bringing that up. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, it's all right. Hey, and then, maybe year number five will get it right. <laughs> yes. No, it's funny because when, when I was on Superior Donuts, which was a CBS show, and we got our second season, and I've been on several other shows that got canceled season one. So when people would ask me, they'd be like, what's it like working with Katie Seagal from Married with Children, Judd Hirsch from Taxi? What's it like working with these TV legends? And I was like, listen, I'm an actor of Middle Eastern descent. Uh, I'm excited to be in season two because usually we die in season <laughs> one. <laughs> so it was great. Uh, it, it, it was fun. It was fun to do. And, uh, and at the same time, it's great to have stand-up because then, you know, I'm on the road. I'm working on my material. As you said, I had my special on Netflix. I've had several other specials on Showtime. So I'm constantly writing new material. And I'm also writing a lot of parenting material because, again, I have kids. But I also write a lot of political stuff as an Iranian-American. I do Trump jokes. If you come to the show, please don't get offended. It's just a joke. Relax. <laughs> People sometimes get really serious. And when you do a Trump joke, like, it's like you're making fun of their grandmother. I'm like, it's not your grandmother. He's the president. We're supposed to make fun of him. Relax. <laughs> All right, so Maz is going to be performing at the Comedy Zone tonight and tomorrow. And you can find tickets at ComedyZone.com. And also we have a four-pack we're giving away to win that. Go to our sale contest at WJXT.com. And just put in a subject. I want those tickets. Maz, thank you so much for hanging out with us. We thank appreciate you for it. having me. Thank you. Our Thanks, pleasure. You guys. We'll stick around. More River City Life coming up and more.